Hi y'all, this is Larry from Deep South Texas. It's August 11th today and it is hot. And it has been hot for months. <laughs> the garden has been suffering because of that, but the sweet potatoes, they love the heat. But they've been in the ground long enough, it's time to harvest them. So that's what we're going to do today. Now I've only planted one half of a raised bed in sweet potatoes this year. The raised bed is three feet by eight feet because last year we had such a bumper crop of sweet potatoes we couldn't even eat them all. So we cut back a little bit and uh, let's see if that was a good idea or if that was a mistake. The vines are growing all over. Um, the sweet potatoes are planted right here but vines go 16 feet that way and that way and over that way and they're uh, shading out the the cantaloupe vines too. It's going to be hard actually to uh, separate those to get these sweet potatoes harvested. So let's let's take a look at that. So there's the half of the bed where the sweet potatoes are planted. They have uh, taken over most of this pathway going all the way up to the front of the garden there moved over to my wheat field they're headed off in that direction and they've taken up this pathway as well so we're going to try to get this cleaned up the first thing I'm going to do is uh, start clipping off sweet potato vines leaving I don't know six inches to a foot off of each uh, each vine so we can get in there and start harvesting. Okay, let's start uh, clipping off some of these vines. Well, this is going to take a little bit, so uh, let me finish, finish clipping them off and then we'll come back and take a look. So I have a wheelbarrow full of vines. I'm going to take them back to the compost. And uh, we see some sweet potatoes sticking up above the ground, so we got sweet potatoes. Those three sweet potatoes came up when I was pulling up the vines and a couple small cantaloupe. After getting all the sweet potato vines out of there, found out my cantaloupe vines were dead, but there were a couple small cantaloupe in there, so not a total loss. Well, let's, uh, let's start digging these and see what we end up with. Well, let's start up in this, in this corner here. See if we can just pull some up. One nice one there. Much more in the ground yet. A 
Wow. That's a pretty nice haul off that one plant. Oh, there's another one there. All right. Well, we're going to have sweet potatoes, that's for sure. So our next plant is right here. Wow. <laughs> Real nice. Oh, another pretty productive plant right there. Well, let's, uh, I'm going to keep going and uh, we'll come back when I get them all dug up and see how we did. Well, a pretty good haul of sweet potatoes out of this three foot by four foot bed. Some huge ones. I wasn't expecting anything this big this year. I was hoping, you know, to get them out a little bit smaller, but uh, it is absolutely amazing the amount of food you can grow in a small space. And sweet potatoes seems to uh, be at the top of the list for production. Another successful sweet potato harvest. Couldn't be happier. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again next time.